We're going to do some bar hopping. Newlyweds Sarah and Phil Hunt are in Orlando for their honeymoon. And along with what could be big crowds, they plan to celebrate the end of 2021 in downtown Orlando. Explore the city. We've Check never out been Wall here. Street. Also, yeah. We heard that that's a good party yeah. there, all blocked off. So. Yep. Wall Street is home of what's normally one of the biggest celebrations. Several bars in one little area, eight venues and a DJ. And this year, no real restrictions like masks. It's basically back to pre-COVID. And the party outside will go until 3 a.m. One place you can bet will be busy tonight is Thornton Park. It's going to be a street party. We saw crews setting up the barricades to mark off the two blocks in Thornton Park of East Washington Street where all the taverns like Burton's 808 and Graffiti Junction are coming together for the celebration with three stages and DJs starting at 830 tonight. Some though are skipping downtown and waiting for midnight at the theme parks. Actually, we're going to be there until pretty much like hopefully until it closes because I think it's supposed to close today at like 2 a.m. or something like this. For those who do come downtown, you can see the orange ball from the ground on Church Street, but this year it will not be dropping. The company that owns the bars here says the drop has been canceled, not because of COVID, but because Latitudes is closed for now. There also won't be a block party on Church Street as we've seen in years past. In Orlando, Bob Hazen, West 2 News.